Hi, this is Maura from Main Street ROI, and today I'm going to be talking to you about how to make the most out of your Google Ads budget by looking at and analyzing your click-through rate. So what is click-through rate? It is the percentage of impressions of your ads or keywords, you can see it in a bunch of different places, that actually resulted in a click. So of the number of times your ad was viewed, how many times someone actually clicked it. So as a metric, we use this to show how relevant searchers are actually finding your ad to be. Um, and it can be a good indicator of maybe we need to change up the ad copy, maybe our site link extensions or other assets can be tweaked a little bit to better match our keywords or vice versa. Maybe this isn't a relevant keyword for our campaign and we can exclude it there so we're not getting any extraneous searches or affecting our click-through rate. So click-through rate is very important because it does contribute to your ad rank. As we know, ad rank determines how you place in auctions each time a search on Google is made. Um, Google looks at your actual click-through rate, which is going to be this column right here, versus your expected click-through rate, um, which is the click-through rate that Google expects from the keyword across any advertisers ad campaigns. Um, and that helps determine how your ad may rank or how that portion contributes to rank. So what this means as well is a poor click-through rate can lead to low ad positioning, no matter how much you're pushing, you know, bigger bids or more money towards it. So using these tools, you can get your click-through rate up and in turn get your add rank up, hopefully start ranking higher, appearing more. Um, and this could also possibly result in a lower cost per click, which would save you more money in your ads budget. So as we're looking at click-through rate, you can see expected click-through rate and then historical click-through rate. Historical looks at how your ads have done basically compared to what they expected them to do. So um, we always want to be average or above average on either one of these. But um, if you're ever at below average, this is a great indication to, once again, look at your keywords, look at the ad relevance, and see if there's anything you can change or update to improve your click-through rate or um, you know, exceed the expected click-through rate. So I hope you found this helpful and now have a few ways to look at your click-through rate in a different light. Um, Main Street ROI partners with small businesses to help you learn and grow your Google Ads, website, SEO, Facebook ads, anything you can think of. Um, so if you found these helpful, keep watching our videos to get more good tips. Or you can also head over to our website um, where we can engage in a conversation and see how we can help your business continue to grow. Thanks. Bye.